Howdy guys. I'm over here sitting in the truck. Just been working on it. And I thought I'd, thought I'd stop for a second and uh, do a video, an unboxing video. Dave Lewis is a gentleman that's been subscribed to the channel for some time. And he's a great dude. Always got great advice. He's um, built some crazy engines. Very smart guy. Cool dude to have around. And I was doing the live stream on Sunday. And he popped in and said, hey, you don't answer your email. And I was like, yes, yeah, I'm bad about that. But um, Dave sent me an email, and he's you know he's asking for my address. He says, hey, you know I'd like to send you a couple books, and you know I, I always appreciate the gesture, so I obliged him. And sure enough, I got a package day before yesterday, and um, here she is. Open it up. I did I did everybody the honor of opening the box. I didn't want to shit myself on camera. But Dave sent me some literature here. Pretty great stuff. I don't know where to start. There's a couple books here, but it's David Vizard's How to Build Max Performance Chevy Small Blocks on a Budget. Pretty relevant, really, really helpful. Also, David Vizard's How to Super Tune and Modify Holly Carburetors. And last but not least, how to rebuild Rochester Quadrajet carburetors. Dave, I can't tell you how much I appreciate the thought and the gesture, and the, these are just amazing, man. You know, that's going to be good reference and good knowledge that I'll use. You know, you see, I drive this truck, I'll be using it every day, man. I really appreciate it, brother. That was incredibly kind and incredibly generous of you, brother. Which, uh, again, you know what I mean? I. I'm sure you know what I'm working on. That's why you bought the books, but it's some pretty great timing because it, I don't need a close-up of my face there. I shouldn't do that. Look what I'm getting into, Dave. Rebuilding this old Q-Jet. And uh, this one was from work, which is probably why there's that nice 7 16 washer sitting in, that, in the secondaries. I didn't remove that. I figured I'd leave it for YouTube's sake. But yeah, I'm getting into this thing, guys. So I'm going to read what I can out of the manual, see if I can do anything different or extra to this carburetor, and see how it comes together. The only carburetor I've ever really rebuilt was my single barrel Rochester, so I guess it's the same thing, just times four, right? There's that close-up again that you guys don't need. <laughs> but yeah, Dave, thank you so much, man. That was, uh, it's incredible of you. I, I hope I get a chance to return a favor, you know, help you out with something. If I ever get any merch, I'll make sure to send you some. But uh, thank you so much, man. Everybody um, chiming in, all the positive well wishes. You know, the truck's coming along. I'm going to do an update soon, uh, actual video update. I appreciate you guys, too. Thanks, everybody. And make sure to check your fluids.